Hello, welcome to the YD tutorial. And in this tutorial, we will cover the part one and part two of the tutorial, which I have published on my website, shahid-academy.com. So let's first open the file uh, in the Y editor. First, let's see what we have got in our current directory. Let's do pwd, which means present working directory. And now do listing of the file. We have got a file, shahid. I've already created it as a text file, so I will open it in Y editor. Y and Shahid, and now here we are in the um, file. Okay, now to go to the first line of the file, press GG. And if you want to go to the bottom of the file, just press Shift G. And if you want to go one line up, one line at a time, press up arrow key or press K and if you want to go down one line at a time, press J or down arrow key or hit enter and if you want to move to the right side one character at a time, press L key or right arrow key or if you want to go to the left side press left arrow key or backspace press H key to go left one character at a time here you can see the name of the file as well at the bottom we are in a command mode so what if you want to change one character uh, or we want to add some line to the file so you need to go into the insert mode so press insert key now you can see at the bottom it's insert mode let me add a line end of the file this is I am in the normal mode so I can, I can add a text this is the last line of file full stop ok now I want to save the file Go into command mode by pressing escape key, press colon wq animation mark. You can press this command and hit enter. Okay, now we want to go back to the file to see the changes. Here you can see the last line is here. Okay, now I want to go back into the normal mode. I want to just change the one word so we are in insert mode want to remove file and I can say text file then there is another command to save this change press escape key and then press shift and Z, Z. we have exit we have gone out of the Y editor but the changes have been saved. To verify, go back to the file. Here you can see the line. Now this is the last line of the text file. Okay, now what if I want to delete this line? While I am in a command mode, press DD, and the line is gone. What if I want to delete this line? The next line. And then the next line, I want to delete three lines. Okay, there is a one, another useful command which will display the line number, which will make it easier, you know, to understand how to delete the multiple lines. So press colon number, and here you go. You got the line numbers next to each line. So for example, if I want to delete line 17, 18 and 19, I'll just do number 3 because 3 lines I want to delete, 3, and then press DD. So now it has deleted 3 lines. So I'll copy the one line at a time. So go to line number 13, do YY, and go to line 15, the cursor is at the 15, if you press P, add the line which we have copied the text from line 13 into line number 16 here you go 
what if you want to copy from line number 13 to 16 I will go first to line number 13 there are four lines I will do four and then y y so I have copied 13 14 15 and 16 and I want to paste it at line number 17 so press P and here we got four more lines okay now the next task is to search for a specific string okay I want to go to the top of the file I'm here okay now for example if you want to search for a word tutorial and then we want to replace it with some another word for example guide so press colon percentage s and tutorial and then guide press enter so here you see the word tutorial has been replaced with the word guide you want to change it back to the tutorial so I'll do colon person s guide with tutorial and hit enter now you can see here the word there was a word guide and here there was a word guide so it has been replaced with not tutorial okay now you want to replace all these words one by one so there is another command or it has we can use a flag with gc so let's do that percent, uh, colon and then percent test for search or tutorial then guide and flag with gc so it will search for the word tutorial and then it will replace it with guide globally but before that it will ask your confirmation I do press enter so now we are at the first occurrence of tutorial you want to change tutorial with the guide if you press y it will replace it with the guide if you press no it will not replace it with the guide so let's do let's replace it with the y so it will replace it with the guide the next occurrence I don't want to change it with the word guide so I'll press no and that's it so in this tutorial we have learned how to open a file in Y mode how to navigate within a file how to delete the line how to copy the lines um, and how to search for a string or replace a string in a text file I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial and thank you for visiting my website